Hi, I'm Joe from Webs Online, and today we're going to discuss tea colored water. There's only one thing worse than green water, and that's brown tea colored water. Uh, oftentimes, you'll see this kind of pop up at the tail end of fall uh, throughout the winter. Um, generally, it's brought on by two reasons. Uh, first, being leaves. If you have an abundance of leaves or even a few, these leaves will release tannins into the water and, and stain it, almost like a natural tea. Uh, the second would be sediment. Uh, a lot of this free-floating sediment can appear, can make your pond appear uh, that it's stained when ultimately it's not. How do we treat? You can take a glass from the kitchen, scoop up some of the pond water, bring it indoors, let it sit for about a day, come back. If the water is still stained, then you have tannins that have released into the pond water and ultimately staining the water. If you have a high level of sediment uh, and the water is actually somewhat clear, you have the majority of sediment and not so much tannins. Now that we've determined what the issue is, we can treat accordingly. If the water is stained, you can use carbon, which is a chemical filtration. It will actually absorb these colors. And you can basically just put this in a mesh bag. Uh, you can put it in your skimmer. You put it in your biofilter, anywhere, there's, anywhere where there's running water. Uh, if you have sediment, uh, you can treat with bacteria. This will uh, digest and eat up a lot of that organic matter uh, and ultimately leave your pond water clear. If you have any additional questions on these treatments, feel free to give me a call. My name's Joe from Webs Online. Talk to you then. Thanks for watching our video. Don't forget to leave your comments and questions below. We want to make sure we're making the right videos. So don't forget to follow us on our YouTube channel and all our social media platforms.